This is officially Bakery Mondays, baby, where I go to a local bakery in your neck of the woods, potentially, instead of doing a crumble review. We don't need more crumble reviews, dude. Welcome back to another episode of Trying Shit, so you don't have to. Today I'm in West Seneca, New York at Eileen's Bakery, baby. This pops up one take. You know the deal. See what we're working with here. I got a whole bunch of shit, baby. It was like 25 bucks, dude. This right here is a peanut butter brownie bar or something we'll start off with this i got like eight million bags here that's okay though this is officially bakery mondays baby where i go to a local bakery in your neck of the woods potentially instead of doing a crumble review we don't need more crumble reviews dude shout out to all my local bakeries out there if you know of a good one in your neck of the woods put it in the comment section down below and i might just show up here we go mm. It's like sticking to my roof of my mouth, dude, like a load of wet paint. Holy shit. That right there is rich. The peanut butter. Look at that. I, I don't, you can't see the roof of my mouth, but it's caked up with peanut butter, dude. Very, very rich. And you have some shit on the bottom. I don't know if that's cro like cross-contamination with like a powdered sugar donut or something, but I'm glad it happened, dude. One more bite. Here we go. Mmm. That's a decadent little treat there, Eileen. Overall score, I'm that guy. I got to go. 8.7 out of 10. Next up here, we have an almond horn. I almost got like the whole almond ring thing. They're famous for these apparently. Um, but the almond ring was uh, like 15 bucks, dude. I was like, I, I'm already spending, you know, 25 or whatever. Stuffed in the middle there. Here we go. Got some nice almonds on top. Mmm. Ooh. Soft. Supple. Moist. Omini, dude. That right there. I need I just need that. I just need like a little. I just need to finger it for a second and just get a little bit of that almond paste. Delightful. Absolutely delightful. And the glaze on top. Awesome little almond horn, dude. Getting me a little bit horned up, if you will. Overall score on the almond one. I gotta go. 8.6 out of 10. Next up here. We have something very similar looking, but this is a apple. So oh look out. That one's that one's packed out with apple, dude. I almost kind of wish the uh, almond one was looking more like this. Oh, it's crumbling a little bit. Crumbling a little bit, dude. Hopefully this is uh, this is gonna work out okay here. Here we go. Almond one was better, dude. Definitely almond almond one was better, dude. This this guy right here, it's almost kind of bland. It's almost kind of bland on the inside. You're expecting like a burst of appley flavor. But it's a very similar but less potent filling than the almond one. You get a little like juicy apple right there, but I want to I want to see this thing riddled with apples. Um, if you're calling it an apple slice. Overall score, apple guy. Thanks, babe. I gotta go. I'll go 6.9 out of 10. We got a couple cookies here, dude. And then another bag with shit in there. I don't know what's in there. This right here is like a caramel apple cookie. Look at the the ridges, dude. You can see the caramel right there. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The caramel. Fantastic flavor on that. You're getting a little cinnamon, cinnamon, cinnamon action. One more bite, we'll give it a score. It's almost a little dry. And dare I say, do I want raisins in this? Just for a little texture contrast and a little bursting boba of flavor almost. I think raisins in this would be fantastic. And I, I don't think I've ever said that about anything ever in my entire life. Overall score, this guy right here, I gotta go. I'll go seven flat out of 10. Next up here, chocolate chunker. This is a very flat cookie. I like my bitches a little thicker, if I'm just being honest, dude. If you're gonna be this thin, I'd rather see crispy. That's just me, though. It's it's chewy, 
and yet thin. Not my favorite. The chunks in there are great. Um, overall score on this. Let's move on to the last item here. Overall score on this chocolate chunk cookie. Thanks, babe. There's so much shit. Overall score on that guy. I got to go. Mm, I'll go 7.1 out of 10. There's two donuts in here, dude. This is like a cinnamon cruncher, they called it. Oh, yeah. Look at that, dude. A little dry. A little dry. For sure. The crunchies on top are great. They just are. The icing's awesome, too. I think it's a very similar icing that was on the the other shits with the uh, cinnamon, the almond ring. That's a, that's a delightful little bite right in the top in the middle there. But I know for a fact, if I were to take that bite right there, it'd be just a little dry. Another donut in here. Last item. Overall score. Cinnamon crunchy. I got to go. I'll go six. Point seven out of 10. This is a white cream donut here. It was a strange donut, dude. Was that like a trapezoid? I think it's a trapezoid, dude. Ooh, that cream is delicious, dude. Holy shit. It's straight up like this like vanilla-y, almost like marshmallow-y, delightful little cream. But the overall donut itself, lacking on the icing dude that right there you're skimping out on the icing on top overall score on this donut just needs more icing overall score 7.3 out of 10